Bucky's best friend is a girl who lives next door named Rachel, who was born with Down syndrome. Rachel likes to play, and so does Bucky. They play with Bucky's dog, Bandit. They fish together. They run together. They play board games together. Rachel has big, beautiful, round eyes and a smile that is the friendliest smile in the world. She is very kind to others and always tries to be everyone's best friend. Bucky and Rachel ride the school bus together every day. They sit on the same bench and share stories along the way. Some of the kids make fun of Rachel. Some kids think that Rachel is different because she has Down syndrome. Rachel is just like any other kid. Rachel has feelings, talents, and goals. Bucky knows that Rachel is just like his other friends in all the right ways. Rachel is kind to others, works hard, and plays fair. One day, Bucky watched Rachel at school during lunchtime. Some of the girls were sitting together and Rachel tried to join them. The girls spread out and told Rachel that there was no room for her. As she walked away, they laughed and teased her. They hurt Rachel's feelings. Rachel walked away with tears in her eyes as she passed Bucky. He asked her if she wanted to sit with him. She sat down, but nothing was said. How could kids who did not even know Rachel treat her so poorly? Bucky wanted everyone to see just how cool Rachel really was, so he came up with a plan. Maybe if the kids saw Rachel in a different way, they might realize that she had feelings, talents, and goals just like them. The school art contest was next week, and Rachel was good at drawing, so Bucky asked Rachel to draw him a picture of his dog, Bandit. Rachel was excited and went right to work. She drew a perfect picture of Bandit, sleeping on a grass bed with a stuffed Raggedy Ann doll by her side. Bucky put Rachel's drawing in the art contest. No names appeared on the drawings. Voting day arrived, and lots of kids gathered around Rachel's drawing, saying, Cool dog! Awesome picture! Big time talent! All the kids voted, and everyone was excited to hear the results. Mr. Wrench, the principal, stood up in front of the whole school to announce the winner. He opened up the envelope and said, The winner! of the Springboro School Art Contest is a drawing called A Sleeping Bandit by Rachel. Everyone stood up and cheered as Rachel proudly walked up and accepted a big trophy. Bucky watched as all the kids now saw how talented and cool Rachel really was. Rachel raised the trophy above her head and smiled from ear to ear. The next day at lunchtime, Rachel carried her lunchbox, and one of the girls who turned her away earlier invited Rachel to join them. Her name was Susan, and all the girls apologized to Rachel. They explained that they didn't understand Down syndrome before, but they learned from Rachel that people should not be judged before you really get to know them. They all became friends. Bucky sat with Rachel on the school bus home. Rachel kissed Bucky on the cheek and handed him a present. He untied the bow and unrolled the paper. It was the drawing of his dog, Bandit. Bucky framed Rachel's beautiful drawing and it hangs in his house in a most special place. Rachel has goals and dreams. She wants to be a great actor on Broadway someday. And she participates in all the school plays and is captain of the local muse machine here in Springboro, Ohio. Her other goal was to assist in the illustrations of this story. 
and I'm very grateful to her mother Amy and to Rachel for providing these wonderful illustrations for Bucky's best friend. You see, Rachel has other goals and dreams. As a little girl, she wanted to be a princess, or maybe even a queen. In October of 2009, Rachel called me to invite me to the homecoming football game. I sat in the stands and watched the game, and Rachel joined the other girls on the field to be honored at halftime. But little did I know what was to come next. The announcer announced Rachel as the homecoming queen for the class of 2011. Rachel's dream had come true.